do 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 the busted button. I'm telling you guys, it's absolutely beautiful out here today. The weather is great. We just left. What? It's hot. Nah, it's it not is. that hot. It's not, it was 100 degrees, 105 degrees like still three weeks ago. It's still 100 degrees. Oh, it's 85 Eighth, degrees. Now we're, yeah, it's 85. So 85, that's, 100, same it'll, <laughs> it'll probably be 90 by the end of the day. <laughs> but um, we're, going to, we're going to head to an estate sale. And we don't know what, did we see any pictures of this one? I did, but yeah, there yeah. wasn't. A lot of pictures. Nothing, yeah, not not a lot, and, and not a lot of things that we would typically go for. But you just never know when you go to an estate sale. I'm sure it's hard to take pictures of every single thing they have, so right. just never know. But uh, no matter what happens, no matter if we didn't find anything or not, the Astros won last night. <laughs> and if you don't like the Astros, I've said this before, you can go pound sand. Josh, because I love the Astros. Oh, nice. Everybody loves to hate the Astros, but. Uh, yeah, so Sunday they play again. We'll definitely be watching that. But uh, if we find something good today, that will just top off the weekend. So, all right, here we go, guys. For the Christmas tree cabbage patch, nineteen eighty-four. Can I get it? Look at all these games. Want to get it? Okay. Can you hold on to it for me, please? Me and Dad can get it. Me and Dad can get plungers. Well, we don't have a Wii. We used to have a Wii. Yeah. Me and Dad used to have a Wii. That's cool. That's cool. Space case. Yeah. Me, me and Dad used to have a little mm -hmm. that one thing. You did, that's right. That's right. And then I had Mario Kart. Mm-hmm. And that, and the other I was, I was so bad. You were so bad. Okay, like, go back, go back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I walked right into this office and I was like, man, there's some nice stuff in here still. And yeah, there's a bunch of trains. I have to look some of those up. But what caught my eye was this. And then I turned it over and it was Proto. And I know Proto's a really good brand. So it's half price. We're paying ten dollars for it and it sells for sixty. The last one sold for sixty. So we're gonna get that for sure. And then I'm gonna start looking some of this other stuff up. I'll take this and see if they have somewhere to put it. Bunch of knives over here. Can you look up that huh? that brand? Look at that. Yeah. Just sit it down. Yeah. No, mm -mm. wait, I don't think we can go up there. I know that's a good one. Step back, step back, please. All right, so we ended up getting the uh, tool, the Proto uh, Torque Wrench. I think it's going to go for about 70, 60 or 70. Mm. And then Kelly got the knife, and that, that was going to sell for about how much? I don't remember. We paid oh, 20 and yeah, it looks like maybe. They sell for like 60 or yeah. something. Yeah. So, Westhoff classic German knife. And then she got a Christmas Daddy. ornament. I didn't know if that was for us or. I don't know. I didn't look it up. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see what, it, uh, what it sells for. We're making it. It's a Star Wars Christmas ornament. found two really nice ones i found this palmander place and we've sold this before and i knew it was an excellent brand there's a tag if you've never seen it sell through is almost 100 percent. i'm paying eight bucks for it and i'm thinking i'm probably going to list this for 60 probably get closer to 50 but i'm going to list it for 60 and i also found this wild about cashmere Saks fifth avenue 100 cashmere sweater uh, the sell through is not really great, but the ones that are selling are selling for like 50 bucks. So I'm definitely going to get both of those. I think this is a men's sweater. It's pretty nice. This fig and flower was right on the end, and I almost walked right past it. 
fig and flower. We haven't been picking up a lot of these lately, but this print's pretty nice. It's in a really good shape. It's not a high dollar item. We'll probably list it for 25. All right, I'm gonna show you guys what I found. I found three J. Jill dresses. Two of them are not linen, and this one is linen. The non-linen dresses in this size 2X are over 100% sell through. I'm paying $10 a piece for all of these. This one uh, is gonna do a little bit better because it's linen, but don't, don't pass up J. Jill. I killed the dress aisle today, guys. So I went back over there. I kind of got pushed out of the way. There was a lot of people over there I had to move, but I went back over there and I found another made well. Well, I found two made wells. They're in excellent condition, I'm paying 10 bucks. Made wells dropped off a little bit, but I think their dresses are still holding their value. So I'll probably list these for 30, try to get 25 or so. They're really nice. They're really clean. Some good finds. All right, it's Saturday morning, and it's been raining a lot here, man. Like, what, for two days now? Mm -hmm. I checked the rain gauge this morning, and there was five inches in there. And did you dump out three and a half inches? I did not dump out. Okay, so we got a total of five inches of rain in the last That's two days. That's a lot of rain. Yeah. And we, we haven't had rain this summer at all here in Texas, so it's, uh, it's nice to get it, but it makes it kind of a gloomy day. But anyway, we're going to go to a couple garage sales first thing this morning, and then we have an estate sale we're going to go to after that. So, I don't know. It's going to be a good day. Let's go see what we find, guys. So, we ended up coming into an impromptu uh, estate sale. We didn't know it was going to be an estate sale, but I don't know. We're, we're checking it out. There might not be a whole lot of stuff, but Kelly's digging deep. <laughs> Found some scarves, yeah. a whole box of them over here. I'm gonna, mm -hmm. I'm gonna look up a couple of the names. Yeah, Kelly doesn't do scarves. <laughs> <It's> overwhelming. <laughs> but I'm gonna look at some up. Kelly found something pretty cool. So Let her tell you about yeah. them. They're uh, Laura Ashley, mother and child. These are the kids' uh, rompers. So they're corduroy, really nice. They'll sell for probably 30, 35 bucks. That's really cool. Yeah. Vintage, obviously. Oh, yeah, that's really neat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Mm -hmm. I found this radio. Pocket scanner. I'm going to look it up. I don't know. They want 20 for it. Yeah. It may be worth it. Maybe not. All right, so we're headed to the estate sale. This is the bona fide estate sale, not the yeah. impromptu estate right. sale. And this one's the estate sales by Regina. She does pretty good estate sales you know she uh yeah. been to a few of hers so we'll go in here and see what we find yeah this is roseville pottery if you guys have never seen it uh, yeah it's all kind of similar patterns different colors though and uh it's very distinct you can tell roseville pottery No fish and lures can be worth so much money. I just don't even know where to start. Some signed artwork. So we were on the Goodwill side of town, so we, we ran over to uh, the Goodwill over in Bryan. We're going to see what we can find. <laughs> Kelly's killing it over here in the jeans aisle, so I had to come over. I'm going to get over here so I can. Okay. So she found all of these, look, on this row, from yeah, most of them from like here to there. <laughs> so these, Josh found um, a dress that was driftwood last week. And I don't know if it's like boutique or what, but it's very expensive and they sell really well and they're very cute. So we got two of those.
in there. And Those are probably at least fifty dollars jeans, right? Well, I don't know. Maybe I'm more. Look, but yeah. Probably. And then this brand I haven't found in forever. I'm Mother. glad we found this. Yeah. So we can yeah. Show them. That. I very rarely find these, but these are like three hundred dollars at Neiman Marcus. Um, and then I don't find this very often either. Rag and Bone is the brand. And these are also in excellent condition. These are also very expensive. And then I found, okay, so I'm gonna pick these J. Jill denim jeans up. So I know we picked up a lot of J. Jill linen shirts. Um, and this has a pretty good sell through and a half price. So I'm gonna try these. I have to wash them in a little spot, but whatever. And then this is um, IC. So we picked up some IC by yeah. like Connie Kastner or something like that a while right. back. But these are from Dillard's and they have a tag on them. So, uh, and they're half price, so I'm gonna get those. And then of course, I found some yeah. vintage Rockies uh, here. So, pick those up. I told her those are like the skinniest Rockies I've ever seen, but anytime you find Rocky Mountains, that's pretty good. Yeah. What so, size are they? Yeah, I'm trying to. I'm trying to see. <laughs> yeah, they're a size three. <laughs> so, yeah. Man, that's a hell of a score for just a little, little area of jeans, yeah. so. I told her when we came in here, I haven't went down the jeans, that jeans aisle in a long time. Yeah, so. it's clearly so. Awesome. These just don't sell. But I know. This also, it, this, these are also very expensive They jeans. sell these at Neiman Marcus at Will as well, but they just don't sell. I've I don't stopped picking them up because. Yeah, I don't pick them up either, but I'm, I'm going to look. I'm just going to look this, look it up, see if anything's changed. So I found some more uh, J. Jill, probably with the collection that you found a few days ago. Right, it looks like it came from the same person, right? Yeah, that's uh, this one is a different one. It's called uh, Pure Jill, but it's the same same brand. And Another then, dress too, yeah. Uh -huh, and the Dang. J. Jill, and then this is I think this one's a different one. Too. Yeah, this one is also called Pure, Pure Jill. Jill. Uh huh. But it's nice dress. And then here's another linen one. Man. So. That's awesome because these are the oh. J. Jill has been selling really well for us. One more thing, I found these A Gold pants. This is another Nordstrom brand that's like 300 bucks. So that's wild. Yeah, that's it. That's all. That's crazy. Exciting. I think that's going to be it for us, <laughs> for us guys. Uh, so that was a week worth of thrifting all in one video. That's kind of how I, I format things. Kind of how I do it, but. Anyway, I think we're going to go get some lunch and enjoy the weekend. Yeah. All right. If you keep watching, we'll keep making the videos. We'll see you next time, guys.